Hey everyone, welcome back to S4K Tennis. My name is Coach Mark and this is my friend Addison. And today we are going to be teaching you the skills from our S4K Tennis program and our practice at home books, which we give to our parents, children and coaches all over the UK at our tennis lessons, which you can book a free taster for at sportforkids.biz. Would you like to play some tennis, Addison? Can you give me a big high five? Big high five and we will get started. So today we're going to be working on our forehand but before we can do our forehand, we have to remember our different parts of the tennis racket. So we have to pick up the tennis racket to start with. So Addison, can you take your hand? Oh, high fives. One, five. Excellent. And can you put the hand, your hand, one hand, on the face of the racket like this? Okay, so Addison's going left hand, so that's fine. So I'll mirror that. So left hand, and then Addison, can you, put your, can you bring your hand down to the handle of the racket? So you want to use right hand now. Okay, so down to the handle. So just here, and then hold onto the handle like this, and pick it up. Aye, very good. And then come stand over here for me. Hold onto that racket, hold onto it, and bring it up like this in front of you. So like this, and we bring it up like this. So we're gonna make sure we've got the chopper grip going on here, so we keep it like this. So hold onto it, hold on tight, hold on tight, hold on tight, got it. And then chop, show me how you chop. Show everyone how you chop. Oh, very good. So little chops only, little chops. Little, little, little. Bit bigger, bit bigger. Little, little, little. Bigger, bigger, big chops. Oh, we've got to use the other hand. You've got to stay with the same hand if you can. So this one here, you're using the right hand. Like this, chop, chop, chop. Very good, okay. And then can you really gently, shh, see how quietly we can put it on the floor, ready? Gentle, gentle. Oh, well done, big fives. Excellent, okay. Can you stand just there for me? So we're gonna to teach today, we're gonna to be teaching our forehand, and we're gonna do this across four different levels. So firstly, we're gonna try and learn the movement. Then we're gonna to learn to do it with a balloon. Do you like balloons? Yeah, we'll do it with a balloon a bit. Then we're gonna use our magic ball, which is essentially a ball on a string. And then we're gonna try and see if we can feed the ball over the tennis net, okay? So, to start with, I need to introduce you to our character. So stay there for me. And we're gonna bring in Fable the Ferret. So Fable the Ferret looks like this. So, can you say hello to Fable the Ferret in a big way? Hello, Addison. Do you hear that? Who was that? Was it Fable? Yeah, big wave then, give, give, give a big wave. Very nice, excellent. Okay, so Fable the Ferret is gonna teach us our little rhyme. So Fable the Ferret is very special. Can you remember, what is Fable the Ferret? She likes to go, ah, what is she? A pie, not a pie, a pyra. Pirate. Pirate, can you give your last ah noise? How do you make an ah noise? Ah, very good, okay. So Fable the Ferret teaches us a little rhyme, and this helps us get the motor skills to teach our children how to play tennis and do the forehand. So, first thing, we're gonna to have to pick up our racket. So we pick up our racket. So remember, to pick up our racket, what do we do? Hand on the face, and then we drag it down, and we pick it up from the handle just down here. So which hand are you gonna use this time? This one, okay, so bring it down. So all the way down, all the way down like so, and then you're gonna pick it up. So stand up now and pick up the racket. And bring up, excellent, very good. And remember, make sure we can chop, chop. So we'll make sure our grip allows us to chop, chop. Gentle, chop, chop, chop. Okay, right, so first thing we do, we've got to learn our little rhyme. So stand up for me. And mums and dads, you can practice this at home with your children. Oh, we've gone off camera, where are we? Quick, Addison, back here, quick as you can. To the purple, three, two, one. Excellent. They say never work with children or animals, and today we are working with both. So, we are going to be learning our little rhyme, and teaching this little rhyme can really help them practice at home. So Addison, I'm gonna help you with this, because it's quite tricky, and tennis is one of the hardest sports to teach, to be honest, because not only are we teaching a toddler hand-eye coordination, we're also teaching racket coordination, which is an extension of the body, does make it a little bit tricky. So, Addison, can you come over here for me? So we've got, we've got our racket like this, and here's the little rhyme. So we're gonna stand like this, just to the That's it, very good, well done. Right, so we're gonna say, we're gonna say, drop the anchor, so we're gonna bring it down behind us, okay? Then we're gonna say, fire the cannon, which means we bring the racket up, and we're gonna fire it. And then we go, there she goes, there she blows, big nose. Now the big nose is important to get, make sure we have the right finish after we've struck the ball. So we're gonna go, drop the anchor, fire the cannon, there she blows, and we bring it up, and we finish with a big nose, bringing the racket across our face. Ready, one more time, here we go. Ready, here we go, drop the anchor, then we say, fire the cannon, there she blows, big nose, like that, okay? So let me show you as well. So Addison, can you see if you can copy me? So we're gonna, we're gonna pick up the racket, so pick it up, 
and we're going to drop the anchor behind us like this. Can you bring it behind you? So just round this way. Come back, uh, come back, show me chopping, show me chopping. Chopping, gentle, gentle. Just with one hand. Just one hand. Just one hand. So can we use this one because this is the one you like to use. Can we swap her? Good girl, well done. Little chops. And then we're going to drop the anchor down to the side, like this. We'll not drop it all together. We'll drop it all together. So, Jack, uh, be on here for me. Right, so we're going to drop the anchor. I'll do it with you. So we're going to drop the anchor. And then we say, fire the cannon, we bring it up. And then we go, there she blows. And we go, big nose. Big nose, can you do this? Big nose, well done. All right, back down. Show me, drop the anchor. So we're going to, well, we can drop the racket. Then we're going to do drop the anchor. So hold the racket for me, please. One more time. One more. So we're going to go to the side, so over here. So make sure we're facing this way. We are going to drop the anchor. Fire the cannon, bring it up. There she blows. And what do we do? Big, big nose. Can you show me big nose? Big nose. Excellent. All right. So one more time then. One more time. And then we're going to finish this. And we're going to see if we can use our balloon. You want to play with the balloons? Yeah? All right. Okay. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to start one more time. So in front, show me little chops. Little chops. You've changed hands again. Do you want to use that one this time? Which, okay, you can use that one again. That's fine. And then we are going to go down to the side. So drop the anchor. And then bring it up. There she blows. Big nose. Big nose. Hey. Pop that racket down the floor. And give yourself a big clap. Very good. Excellent. High fives. Excellent. Now we're going to move on to using our balloon. Right, so Addison's now going to see if she can use her forehand and our little rhyme with Fable the Ferret and see if we can strike the balloon, okay? So Addison, make sure your feet are nice and comfortable on that spot. So maybe not quite together. Do you want to move them a little bit further apart? Just a little bit. There we go, look at that, very good. Okay, so first thing we have to do, drop the anchor. Oh. Then we have to fire the cannon. And then there she blows, boop, nose. Okay, at the end, all right? So we'll see, after three, when Coach Adam drops it, we'll see if we can do it, ready? Three, two, one. Oh. Ah, oh, well done, very good so far. Okay, so that's a good one. So let's see if we can do a little bit more now. So I've done a lot of that for Addison to help her. And again, at this age, it's really important to get success because we need to keep you interested at this point, all right? So get success is, is really good. Right, so first thing, what do we do? Drop the anch anchor, very good. So we don't put it on the floor. Not too, not too low, oh, she's so strong. Uh, back up, oh. there we go, so drop the anchor. Then we're gonna go, fire the cannon, there she blows, remember, what do you have to finish with? A big, big nose. Okay, you ready? Here we go. Three, two, one, up. Whoa! Look at that, very good. Would you like to have another go? Right, do you think you can do it by yourself? She's like, I don't need Coach Mark. I don't need Coach Mark. Right, okay, so, ready. And so what we're gonna do is we're gonna, remember we've got to do, the, so this, at this point, it's probable that uh, Addison will forget everything I've just taught her and do her own thing. But we need to keep bringing her back to those extra, those little motor skills. So, we've changed hands. Can we go back to the other hand? Good. And then drop the anchor. Let me see if we can do the rhyme without the ball drop, uh, the balloon dropping from it. So drop the anchor. And then fire the cannon. So bring it up. Oh, in front of you, in front. Oh, don't hit me. So I'll come around and help you. I'll come around and help you. So, we drop the anchor. Then we fire the cannon, bring it up, and then uh, there she goes. And what do you finish with? Big. Show you big nose. Big nose. There it is. Okay. So let's repeat one more time. Ready? We drop the anchor, fire the cannon. There she goes. Big nose. One more time. Drop the anchor. Hold it tight. Fire the cannon. There she goes. Big nose. One more time for me. Drop the anchor. Fire the cannon. There she goes. Big nose. One more time. Drop the anchor. Fire the cannon. There she goes. Big nose. All right, Coach Adam, are you ready? So make sure we've got holding on to that. Hold on to it with this hand again. Ready? Drop the anchor. Drop the anchor. Show me how you drop the anchor. So we've got to be behind you, man. So drop it here. Ready? And we're going to do fire the cannon. There she blows. And what do we finish with? What is it? Big. Big nose. Okay, so ready? Drop the anchor. Okay, remember, just keep that anchor dropped until I say. Ready? Here we go. Uh, no, you've got to wait, you've got to wait till it, for it to drop, okay? So the eye uh, balloon coordination is really tricky here. That's why we use a balloon, because it moves slower. So, ready? Drop the anchor. And then, fire the cannon, go. Ah, oh, we missed. So, right, try again. So, bring it down. So, ready? We're going to fire the, we're going to fire, uh, drop the anchor. Fire the cannon, and look where the, uh, and then finish with a big nose. Cannon with a big nose, well done. 
One more time then. So we bring it up. We're just going to rehearse that movement before we drop that balloon again. So we forget the we forget the movements as we go. So we need to make sure we remember them. So here we go. So drop the anchor, and then fire the cannon. You're going to do this. Well, there we go. That's the moment of confidence. I'm standing right in striking distance here, so hopefully I'm not going to get a racket straight in the nose. So show me then. So I'll tell you what. I'll do it. I'll do it to the side over here as well, so everyone can see what we're doing. So remember, drop the anchor behind us. And then we're going to fire, we'll do it without the balloon for a minute. We're going to fire the cannon. So bring it up and then finish with the big nose. Hello? Are you there, Addison? With your big nose. So drop the anchor. Fire the cannon. There she blows. Big nose. So we need to make sure we come up a little bit when we do it. So we need to bring our racket up. Can you bring it up? Up, that's it. And there, we're going to finish. And back to the drop the anchor. Fire the cannon. There she blows. Big nose. But obviously, if the ball is up here, you've got to bring it, you've got to make sure you try and hit it with your racket, okay? Are you ready? So drop the anchor. Wait, wait for wait, it. Wait, wait, wait. Wait for it. Wait for it. Back. So drop the anchor. Ready? Drop the anchor. Three, uh, two, one, drop and go. Hey! How's it? High five! Yeah, one more time then. Back on the back on the spot. Back on the spot. I should mention that Addison's never played tennis before. This is the first time. So Addison, you ready to go again? So drop the anchor. Mummy's coming in a minute, so drop the anchor first. Drop the anchor. And then fire the cannon there she blows. Big nose. Yeah! Yeah, good. Do so you think you can get another one? One more? I think you can do one more, okay? All right, so we're gonna do one more. Ready? Drop the anchor. Three, two, one, fire the cannon. Big nose. Oh, okay. oh the balloon! Oh, and over the shoulder, it's gone. Addison, give yourself, stand this way for me. Give yourself a big round of applause. Well done. Balloon phase passed. Okay, so now that we've learned how to do our forehand with the balloon, we're going to move on to using our magic ball, which is ably held by my friend, Coach Adam here, okay? So, what we're going to do is we're going to repeat what we just did. So, can you hold the bracket with your one hand? So, which hand are you going to use? This one, isn't it? So, make sure we're holding it nicely. And then we're going to do, drop the anchor. And then we're going to fire the cannon. There she blows, and a big nose. Remember the big nose. Ready? Three, two, one, off you go. A big nose. Yeah! Very good. Okay, one more, just to prove it wasn't a fluke. Drop the anchor. Ready? Fire the cannon. There she blows. Big yeah. nose. Oh, and then last one. Ready? So drop the anchor. So should we bring it up a bit higher, Coach Adam? There we go. So, ready? Watching the ball. Drop the anchor. Fire the cannon. There she blows. Big yeah. nose. Hey. So that's our magic ball stage complete. Do you think you can hit it over a net? Let's go. Okay. So now that we have managed to uh, teach Addison how to hit the magic ball and the balloon, we're going to see if we can hit a live feed over a net. And today we're going to use a balloon because it travels a bit slower, it's a bit easier for the hand-eye racket coordination. Um, and we're going to see if we can hit, how many balloons have we got Addison? We've got, can we count? One, two, three, four, five balloons. And we're going to see how many Addison can get, okay, over the net. Right, so I'm not going to help Addison this time, she's learned all the skills, you've seen her do it, let's see if she can do hitting over the net. So Addison, Remember, hold on to the racket nice and tight, and then drop the anchor for me. Ready? Three, two, one. Whoa! Big nose, that's one! That's number one. Okay, right, ready, back again. So make sure you've got your. So drop the anchor, remember that big nose at the end. Three, two, one. Yes! Very good. It's getting very close to my head. Ready, here we go. Drop the anchor. Ready? Three, two, one. Fire can. Big nose, very good! That's three. We're not going to get five, surely. Ready? Drop the anchor. Three, two, one. Big nose! Excellent! Excellent work. And last one. Ready? Drop the anchor. Three, two, one. Fire the cannon. We'll take that one as well. Big nose. Addison, pop that racket down for me. Or put it down gently for me. Show me how you gently put it down. Really gentle. Really gentle. Excellent. Big high five for Coach Adam over the net, please. Big yeah. high five. Two big ones for me. And that is how we teach the forehand shot in tennis. Thanks for watching. You can join any of our S4K tennis classes by heading to www.sportforkids.biz and registering for a free taster. And we'll see everyone soon, won't we? Can you give them all a big wave? Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.